uh, use a contact adhesive with a contact adhesive it has solvents in the mix so you must allow the glue to go off the solvent has to come out of the glue otherwise it will, oh, it will melt pardon me I think the glue's running out. I'll have to fill this up. Right. Very nice. Don't you love the noise? Oh, a bit more. Very nice. Right. Do the spatula. Can I um spread it with? I'll have to use this. Right. Then. Spread the glue about. Oh, I love the smell of this stuff. You won't be able to, um, shouldn't sniff this glue too much. It'll make you high. And use in a very ventilated space. And then keep the windows and doors open. Wow. I see, I do like the smell of this stuff. Been using it for many years. And he didn't do anything to me. Right. Any glue left? Should be some. Not quite prepared, was I? Right, see if I can get all this gunk out. Oh, push! Oh, don't you love that? <laughs> oh, just keep pushing. Oh, doesn't that make you feel better? Now, what I'll do is I'll turn that over. Oh, yeah. Stick it on, wiggle it around. doing it's sticking hmm right let's do let's get this glue Little old. Could have done with getting some new glue out for you for this video, but hey ho. No one's perfect. Right. Ideally, you would get both surfaces fully covered. <coughs> now, you should. should allow it to go off for say five minutes really it's just to get the solvents to come out now if you leave if you put it together like this um, because the solvents in the middle cannot escape it will melt the star of Frank Paul Stone. All right. So the glue's actually gone off quite a lot anyway, because it's old. And the other thing is, I should have worn gloves. So if this glue gets on your hand, it's a nightmare. Try and get off. If I was doing this properly, I would have got glue to the edge. But that's what I'm doing this late in the evening. 
and I'm hungry. Should have got my dinner, should I? Right. So imagine this is dry, all right, which it's not. Give yourself a few minutes. Oh, I love the smell of that glue. Not as, um, can't get as high as you could in the old days. But 30 years ago of working with this stuff, do a day's work of gluing things together. <laughs> Imagine how things were at the end of the day with a group of people busy gluing panels to sheets in a space that did have ventilation but health and safety wasn't quite the same 30 years ago boring isn't it <laughs> right that's moving hey i think it lines up better the other way So I grabbed these bowl, these panels and they just happen to be the same size, sort of. No, it won't work better than that. Right. Well, I'll show you in another video. Now, what I would usually do is I would... Put another layer of hardboard on the back. If you don't, um, you'll find that the wood has a different expansion and contraction to the styrofoam. And so depending on what temperature, what sun's applying to it, going on it, etc., um, it'll warp a little bit. Not much, a little bit. And if you put hardboard on both sides, it stabilizes it. Okay, I hope that video was of some use to you. Now I've got to find something to do with it. All right, thanks a lot. Thanks for watching.